Hello all, in this video we will understand how to join two resistances in parallel and find the value of equivalent resistance using Ohm's law. Here we have two resistances of 5 Ohm each. Connect their terminals using connecting wires as shown. Please ensure the connections are tight. Connect the positive terminal, the red one of the battery with the positive terminal of the ammeter. Connect the negative black terminal of the ammeter with this end of the rheostat. While connecting the rheostat, use these two terminals for rheostat to behave as the variable resistor. Connect the other end of the rheostat with end A of the resistor as shown. Connect and B of the resistor with the negative terminal of the battery. The electric current flows out of the battery then to ammeter, ammeter to rheostat, then the current reaches end A of the resistor and splits into two parts. One goes in this direction and the other part of the electric current goes up through the red wire into another resistor. Then both the currents join at end B. Finally, the total current flows out through the black wire into the negative terminal of the battery. Connect positive red terminal of the voltmeter to end A of the resistor through which the current enters the resistor. And connect the negative black terminal of the voltmeter to the end B of the resistor through which the current leaves the resistor. Let's understand the role of the rheostat here. The current enters through 
एंड ए ऑफ द रियोस्टैट फ्लोज थ्रू रॉड देन टू द जोकी देन टू दीज नंबर ऑफ टर्न देन टू एंड बी एंड देन फ्लोज आउट ऑन स्लाइडिंग द जोकी लाइक दिस द करंट हैज टू फ्लो थ्रू लार्जर नंबर ऑफ टर्न हैंस द रेजिस्टेंस इंक्रीजेस now current has to flow through least number of turns and flows out so the least resistance on sliding the jockey and varying the resistance we note the voltmeter reading as 0.5 volt and the ammeter reading as 0.2 amperes we see the ohms law being followed over here that is v is proportional to i the current and voltmeter readings are now 0.4 amperes and 1 volts decreasing the rheostat resistance the current and voltmeter readings are 0.6 amperes and 1.5 volts readings are 0.8 amperes and 2 volts readings are 1 ampere and 2.5 volts let's record our observations in the observation table Please understand that the voltmeter will always measure the potential difference between two ends of the equivalent resistance. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching the video.